looking at the Renegade's base of operations here. This is Thruster, released in 1985. It does have some bad sticker wear, but I am contemplating picking up some repro stickers for it. Um, I didn't even know this place had existed when I was a kid. I had the command center for uh, the Guardians, but had I known that the Renegades had their own and someone had gotten this for me, I think I would have preferred this. Starting off looking at his sort of jumbo jet mode here. It does roll on a set of four wheels underneath. All right, for the kind of fortress mode here. You flip up the nose fully, it reveals the uh, crazy colored head of the uh, the giant robot mode. The seat on this top level here, I think is molded specifically for Psykill, so there he is. One of the play features of this is um, on this top section where Turbo is, that's a trap door a la Castle Grayskull. I think if you pull this out, it's supposed to trigger it. Mine doesn't, mine triggers whenever it wants to like with the command center there is a there is an elevator the lights and electronics feature of this place that is on the uh, the lower level here um, you turn it on with that switch and if it's working properly this is a motion sensor so the whole idea is that when a, a guardian or whomever walks by here it's trips this sensor and the playset makes this really annoying annoying alarm sound so I'm actually kind of grateful mine doesn't work. And the last thing you want to do for transformation is pull these sections out and swing them up. And they are the arms of the, uh, the giant robot. It also has sort of like a, a grabbing feature here, which is kind of cool. I tend to think if there was a place that I was unaware of back in the 80s, um, it's probably because it wasn't a very good one but I really don't feel like that's the case with Thruster here. I really, really like the look of uh, this playset and all of its features, and I'm kinda bummed that I missed out on it when I was a kid.